Hi everyone, I hope you are all well. So today we are going to have a look and see what the next week will bring for you. Oh my goodness, there are way too many cards. Okay, I'm not gonna take all of them. Let's just shuffle some more. This one came out already. Okay, so what next week is going to bring for the viewer? What is next week going to bring for the viewer? Here in England, the weather is lovely and I am buzzing for some reason. Okay, to be honest with you, when the sun is out, I am always excited and happy. Okay, so from what I can see so far is that uh, some of you are, um, you know, you're in a relationship and it's an amazing relationship. You know, you're both sharing each other's dreams and uh, you are encouraging, you know, when one of you is having a sort of dream, you are encouraging the other person and you are being very supportive and you are always there for your person you know in order to help them and encourage them to follow their dreams or the goals and uh, you know i feel that you are um, going through some very special moments at the moment in your life which is uh, bringing you and your partner a lot of joy so that is amazing now i feel that for some of you you are pretty much kind of what's the right word you are pretty much uh letting love to show you how to learn things it's like uh, you want to make things right so you pretty much kind of you're both open-minded on how to make things work best for yourself and for your relationship so you can improve and again that is an amazing thing now for some of you i feel like there are some sort of obstacles in the way of your happiness but the spirit is telling you not to let this obstacle get in the way of the happiness so if you both put in the work together then you know this will work out okay now when i mean obstacles can be maybe like work related maybe your partner or yourself you know you are working too much or you're having a job which is very demanding maybe this is a long um, distance relationship you know taking how it resonates there are different uh, you know, different situations for everyone out there. Um, but some of you are actually just about to be surprised about something. Some of you might get a gift. Some of you might receive a good news, you know, because it resonates again. Um, now, uh, the Spirit is also telling you that um, try not to mistake a fantasy for a true connection. So if you feel like... Uh, what's the right explanation for this i'm thinking uh, so if you feel like something's too good to be true then it probably is so i feel like some of you you know yeah, there there is this person that you might like and maybe this person is you know pretending that they are are someone that they might not be then you know try to see things for what they really are okay now i feel like some of you might see in a repeating number such as 11 11 and that is um twin flame number really so um uh, some of you might be dealing with the twin flame okay so let's see what else is next week going to bring you is there anything else okay this one actually wanted to come out Yes, as I said before, you know, some of you are, are um, dealing with a twin flame, past life, okay, and um, guilt. So I feel like some of you are having some sort of guilt. I feel like this is related to the couples that are, uh, or the person that is, uh, you know, uh, having a uh, demanding job. So I think you or your person might feel guilty that, you know, they're so busy with the work and they feel, or you feel that you cannot give enough time or you don't have enough time for your person so i feel like obviously you feel quite bad okay so is there anything else that the viewer needs to know right now is there anything else that the viewer needs to know right now okay so in case you're single uh, you are about to meet a new person and um you know and if you um have just been going for a separation with someone i feel that it's time uh, so basically the spirit is telling you to let go of you know the pain the resentment the hate you know and just love yourself put yourself all the attention uh, pull into yourself pour uh, into yourself all the love the attention and everything and even the energy that you gave to the other person just give it to yourself because you really need it at the moment after the breakup okay is there anything else that the viewer needs to know right now okay these two wanted to come out yeah just as i mentioned before you know uh some of you are going for a breakup and uh, now you are pretty much you know focusing on yourself you're doing all the healing you know all the self-work and obviously you, you know 
you are healing, which is amazing. You're doing all the shadow work and inner work. Okay, but also there is, uh, you know, a new person coming in. As I mentioned before, if you're single or even if you're in separation, you know, like some of you, you have been doing already your healing work and there is a new person coming in and, you know, you're going to have an insane chemistry and uh, you're going to like each other equally and, you know, you're going to have a lot of fun together. So this is a, yeah, look at the bottom of the deck, paradise. So this person is going to bring you a lot of happiness, you know, and you're going to really enjoy you, uh, each other's company. So, yes, this is an amazing reading, you know, and I'm really, really happy, you know, for everyone out there that they find it, you know, they're happy and excited. Just me, I don't know why, but I'm just really happy and excited. Anyways, I hope this reading helped, and thank you so much for watching, and I will see you soon with another video. Bye!